All right, our beautiful Bethany. You know, what else can I say? Um, I won't lie. I said, you know, it's not like me. You know, I don't really speak a lot. And, but, um, well, until today. But when I saw, I said, right, I'm not going to cry. But when I saw her upstairs, and I saw her for the first time, I just burst into tears. You know what I mean? So, you know, it was when... Okay, we're, a, we're a, like a special daughter father moment, you know what I mean? So, for you all of you that have got daughters, you've got that to come, you know what I mean? So, enjoy it, cherish it, because it's brilliant, all right? All I can say about Beth is um, I'm an enormously proud father, that's all I can say. You know, I'm going to start crying again in a minute, I hope. I bet if you asked any of Carl's teachers now if he would be a successful tradesman on his own home, have two beautiful kids and just got married, I bet they wouldn't believe you. Anybody who know, has known Carl as long as me and Tate have will know what this lad and his dad have been through together. Also Louise, but how Carl has turned out today, I bet he's up there one of the proudest days of their lives. That can't help reflect on the beautiful journey you've taken. You know, uh, when you were first born, I remember memory that sticks with me when you were first born. You know, they wrap them up in the blankets, go down and put them in the cup in the like little cots and things like that. And I put my big fat thumb on her fingers and her fingers just wrap around my thumb like that. I'd just like to say to Carly, Carly's one of the kind, the true friend who would do anything for anyone to drop her an eye. If you ever need something or something has happened, Carl will soon be there on the floor, because he's a nun. <laughs> Let me welcome our new son-in-law when we first met him and got to know him. We knew then that he was a perfect match for Beth. And I have to say his kindness, humour and his work ethic and more importantly to me and Sharon is a love he's shown for Beth has been unwavering and has been a joy for me and Sharon to see. Firstly, I'd like to say on behalf of me and my wife A massive thank you to every single person who is here today to celebrate our special day with us and to everyone who has contributed to our big day. Without you, we wouldn't have, wouldn't have been able to have the wedding we've dreamed of. Can we just take a minute to appreciate how amazing she looks today? Who would have thought 14 years ago when we met in the Red Lion, it would have led to this? After speaking for a whole year, I finally grew up and took her on a date, and the rest is history. From that very first day, I knew Beth was special, and I wasn't wrong. She's the most beautiful, selfless person you could ever wish to meet, and without her, I wouldn't be the man I am today. Beth's not just my wife, she's my best friend, my bank manager, my cleaner, my accountant, the list goes on. <laughs> All jokes aside, People say you don't marry someone you can live with, you marry the person who you can't live without, and I think that sums it up perfectly. I cannot believe that you are now my wife, but I am so happy for it. Since we have been together, you have made me the happiest man on the planet, and today made me even happier. I cannot wait to spend the rest of our life together. As you both begin your new chapter and journey of your life together, our wish for you both is to always love, cherish, respect one another, always communicate openly, never bottle anything up inside, be each other's shoulder to cry on, and embrace the journey that lies ahead and continue to grow stronger with each passing day, months and years. You gotta give all you got, gotta give all you got for love 
Cause you're here for a moment You give all you got, gotta give all you got for love Cause you're here for a moment You give all you got, gotta give all you got for love Cause you're here for a moment You give all you got, give all you got for love Love